Hi friend, this is Dr. Apoor Mehra. And I'm Dr. Praveen Tripathi. So students, we are starting with Marathon INICT. And uh, from the very beginning, we have been saying one thing that uh, at Cerebellum, the teachers would be working as hard as our students. So keeping that logic in mind, keeping that theory in mind, uh, we wanted to come up with a program which is very intensive, very exhaustive. And uh, that is how the idea of Marathon INICT was born. So in Marathon INICT, in seven days, we will be teaching for almost 81 hours, almost 10 to 11 hours a day. And the whole idea is that we want to cover everything which is important from the viewpoint of INICT exam in those seven days. We are doing it immediately before the examination so that everything remains fresh in your head. So uh, Dr. Praveen said that everything stays fresh in your head because most of the people, most of the students in our experience, they choke towards the end and they just don't know what to do. So here, teachers will prepare as hard with the students to sprint them through the last lap. So we call it as a marathon, but I think it's a sprint towards the end. And also what I believe is what Sir just said that it's going to be 10 to 11 hours a day, right? And the schedule has already been shared. So in some days you will have two to three subjects being covered. So it's a fair idea that how you should approach it. So if tomorrow is my session of pharma, my radiology and maybe of tha together, what should I do a day before to prepare? So, Bhutt, sir, uh, what we are suggesting is that students should at least uh, go through the PYQs of INICT, have, have a broader look so that when you are attending those lectures, you have some basic understanding and some idea. All right. So just go through important PYQs. Don't just come blank, hmm. but come open and the teachers will feed the important things. And I believe that if you follow this right from 28th of October, going till the last day, that is 4th of November, hmm. right? You have the world to win. This is Team Cerebellum, which was of the thought that we are for the students by the teachers. So this, I think, is a gift. Right. Another thing, please remember that it's not going to be easy. 11 hours every day for almost seven to eight days, it's going to be tough. But you have to ensure that you are sitting and watching all those videos. There might be times when you feel that the thing is not going into your head. That's okay. Passive learning will keep on happening. All you have to do is to ensure that you are there in all the classes. We keep on saying this time and again, that if you take your preparation till the last day, half the battle is won. And as far as INICT exam is concerned, Apoor sir says this multiple times. Nobody really you know, imagines that they would crack the INICT examination. It just happens. So even if you are one of those who thinks that it's, it's not going to be the exam that you crack, you might be mistaken. Just give enough efforts in these last days and you never know. Yeah. In my experience, right, I have seen a lot of toppers struggling for a decade not clearing and I have seen supply holders topping mm -hmm. entrance exam and I'll keep on seeing that. Mm -hmm. It won't change. So it is about the simple word that believe and you have to give your 100% and study as he just said, study till the end. If you play till the end, most of the people will drop out. They will panic and if you are with the teachers, you won't. Mm -hmm. I'm sure the best thing with a teacher is that a day with a teacher is more than a decade with the books. So a teacher with experience that they are in cerebellum, I'm sure they will ace your preparation to the next level. All the very best from my side. All the very best, my dear students. Thank you very much.